It is 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Canadian Time, November 24th, 2022. And I know I got a good thumbnail. I have a provocative title. And you're saying, hey, FBRC, do I got to sit through the whole thing? Or, you know, can't you just give us the best part first? And Well, if I do that, it kind of shoots myself in the foot. You get what you like, and then you, you leave and say, yeah, I'll check it out later. And then you never do. Doesn't matter. I've already got Super Chats coming in. There's one. There's another one. I can afford. I can afford to give you what you want. Right at the start. <clears throat> so before we play the music and do all that jazz, let's just give you what you're looking for, okay? FBRC is gonna let you gonna let you have it right away. Okay. Mm. So let's get rolling. Is what you really want. Then we'll get into the music and everything else, and then we'll hang around for an hour. Let's go. So last night, you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping, and today we returned to... Right there. That's the Ministry of Electricity and Water, Ardea Pump Station. That's a government building. Now, I'm going to play this like six times over, that little bit of footage, right? Because you notice that there's all fences and, and other scary-looking stuff meant to protect it. And uh, I promised you receipts. Well, how about from the government of Canada warning you not to be shooting footage of government installations when you're in Kuwait? So let me just leave that sign up there for a little bit. Because if, you know, if, if she's shooting footage of that and publishing it, and it's like, you know, oh, I was just driving around. We're going to go to get a hamburger. And for all they know, that's her excuse. You know, she's just driving around and shooting footage of everything all the time. And that's why it's not, it's not cool. They don't like that kind of thing. And I want to get you a street view from Google Maps. And I couldn't get it because I guess if they have, you know, the Google Maps truck driving around in Kuwait, they chop their arm off or something like that. So we don't have the street view because they don't allow that sort of thing. So um, now let's just pull back. And let's play that. Let's play that a few more times. And so you can get to appreciate it. I'm not trying to like, you know, waste time and stretch things out. I just want you to appreciate because these are tiny little clips, right? So if we don't run them a few times, you don't get to appreciate it. So I'm going to run this like six times if I remember correctly, because I got the pre-recorded stuff. Here's me live with my bubbly drink. We're all going to have fun. And uh, anyway, so stop talking and just run the footage. So this here is the... Oh, okay, I got ahead of myself a little bit. Here's the receipt. I went to the Government of Canada website, the travel advisory thing, and uh, here's what the Government of Canada is going to tell you. Don't do that. If you're going to Kuwait, don't shoot footage of government buildings. So here's a little pre-recorded that I had got already for you earlier. Government of Canada travel advisory website thing, which there will be a link to in the description so you can go to it yourself. Let's uh, get down here and get to the fun parts. Uh, there's the Kuwait travel advice. <laughs> here, let me highlight that. Um Exercise a high degree of caution with regional advisories. Blah, 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 blah. Last updated today, November 23rd. Oh, sorry, that's yesterday. Sorry. I'm sorry. It's a whole day old. <laughs> okay. Um, Kuwait. Exercise a high degree of caution uh, in Kuwait due to the threat of terrorism. Yeah, like, duh. And regional risk, Jalib al sukhoi whatever, avoid non-essential travel due to high crime rates. And, um, okay, okay, okay. Now, we're not going to read all of this. I'm just going to get to the good, good part. Uh, come on. I already have it highlighted. No, I ruined it because I already highlighted other things. Hang on. B U I D L things. That's terrorism. That's not what we want. That's what we want. Photography of government buildings in military or industrial sites, particularly oil fields, is forbidden. Don't photograph people without their permission. So let me just highlight this area here. And we'll read it again. 
Photography of government buildings and military or industrial sites, particularly oil fields, is forbidden. And what Chantel has shot footage of, which is bad enough, and then published, is a government building. And that one was uh, heavily fenced in and meant not to be easily accessible. And, uh, well, there it is. There it is. So uh, let's just uh, carry on with the rest of the reaction. So last night you saw us go to Dream Mall for some about So um <clears throat> so this is what I'm going to run six times, right? So you appreciate it. Like look look at look at all the, you know, the fencing that's around it and uh all those trees are to give it extra cover. That that's on purpose, right? And so um it's it's a government building and it's like heavily fenced in. That it's not a friendly place. They don't want you in there. And Chantel shot footage of it, which is bad enough. And then she published it, which is even worse. And so if you want a receipt, the government of Canada says do not do that because they're aware of the, the laws over there. You can't be shooting footage of government installations. And that's what Chantel did. So if you doubt me, I'm going to run this little clip like about six times. I as in clothes shopping. And today we returned to... So last night you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping and today we returned to So last night you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping and today we returned to So last night you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping and today we returned to So last night you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping and today we returned to so last night you saw us i guess i should stop it somewhere there it's, you know see look, look at all the fences does that look friendly hmm huh? no it's not friendly go to dream mall for some abayas and clothes shopping and today we returned to you know what's also funny i mean there is a giant sign and both of those idiots don't pick up on it <laughs> Chantel, she carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel, she carries the weight. Chantel, she carries the weight of the world. She rose out of bed <sighs> With nothing better to do She's got nothing better to Foo do Foo parsley king <laughs> While she drip dries over Bye. you She makes a mess mm. Orders Uber Eats mm. When her Tinder date is through oh, 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 And if you stand too close to her, what? you'll get the seed if too. <gasps> Chantel, Chantel, she carries the weight, weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel, Chantel, she carries the weight. She carries the weight. Chantel, hello, Chantel. She How's Kenneth, our girl? The weight of the world. I bring pizza and poutine. All right. Uh, so that's what uh, she has published uh, earlier today because it's only 9.40 p.m. Eastern Standard Canadian Time. And, um, yeah, so they're going to go to a grocery store and then they eat chicken towards the end of it. And she shot footage of a government building, which is illegal, and published it. Uh, <laughs> well, uh, here, let, let me uh, let me try to put the jinx on Chantel. All right. 
here, let me zoom in on myself. Chantel has a lifestyle with which she simply does whatever she wants to do. Chantel never has any consequences. And just like her mocking the law about no public displays of affection between men and women and nothing happened, nothing will happen to Chantel for breaking the law and shooting footage of a government building, which is illegal. And then to make it even worse, she published it. Nothing's going to happen. There are no consequences for Chantel to have. Please let me get to the Super Chats. Super Chat Cat, please get up there and say thanks. Deborah Saunders. Get up there, kitty. Get up there. Come on. Come on, Super Chat Cat. We got, we got extra studio stuff and everything. Maybe back here and then get in. Come on. What are you complaining to me about? Spent $130 on these lights and they're still not... It's the camera. It's the Logitech camera. We gotta replace that. Oh, look, there you are. It only took half an hour. Super Jack Kate! It's Super Jack Kate! Thanks for blessing us. Deborah Saunders, hope to bless you back. It's Super Jack Kate! It's Super Jack Kate! Super Jack Kate! Okay, yeah. Thanks very much, Super Saunders. And, uh, um, uh, uh, because these super chats came in a little bit earlier while the fat dummy behind me was sitting up. I got to get to the other one right away uh, before it falls off the chat and I can't get it. Hey, hold me up the other hand. Hold me up the other hand. Get the other one. Hang on, folks. I don't ignore super chats. They all get... Holy cow, can you hold me steady? Let me throw up on camera. Super Jack Kate! It's Super Jack Kate! Thanks for blessing us, Belly Chicken Reactions! We hope to bless you back. It's Super Jack Kate! It's Super Jack Kate! Super Jack Kate! Thanks! All right! Thanks very much, Belly Chicken Reactions. I'm going to get out of here and let you uh, folks get to this thing. Okay! Thank you, Super Jack Cat. Thank you. Mm. Woo. Thank you both, Deborah Saunders and Bally Chicken Reactions. Now let's get back to the reaction itself. Boom. Okay, so the um so she's got her terrible music running. Like what a, a shitty generic little start, you know. Um Shopping groceries and roasted chicken flour. <laughs> oh, let's just get into it. So that terrible music's playing. So that's when it's I wipe out the music in the background. And let me get oh, wait, let, let me get caught up in the chat. There. Mm. Okay, hang on there. Did all the plus we're going to play that footage again of her in the government building. It's it's it, you know it's all it'll be integrated into you know, you know, just just here we go. Various plant stores and nurseries. Yeah, all shot from a fast moving car. Wow, the quality just doesn't improve. Junk. Junk, junk, junk. Great couples channel, Chantel. It, it feels like you're, you're, you're trying to get away with something. Like, all the footage is scared. <clears throat> 60 people here. Thanks for coming by. We're just getting started. You haven't missed anything. Dream mall. Chantel and the other guy are they're, uh, Salah. They're not talking. They're just playing his terrible music. I'm gonna get Lulu. Just look how abrupt the edits are, huh? And when she starts walking towards this guy, she puts the camera down quickly. She's always like shooting for like two seconds and then giving up on it. Ice cream. So you see how the, the camera went down? It's like, oh shit! Because if one person says, "What the hell are you doing?" I'm gonna report. You know, they're in trouble, right? Yeah. yeah. W. Please. Should come. Yeah, what other content do you have? L look, Chantel's gonna stuff herself with sugar. Mm. Yeah, get into it. Look, 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 look how your your hand looks like it's ready to explode. And you know what's your hand doing? Getting you some ice cream. Hey, look, there's the ruling royal family. I don't know who the, <laughs> I don't know who they are. 
<laughs> you imagine you got to walk around, you're going to go to the clothing store and you got to see these guys everywhere you go. And if you criticize them, they cut your arm off. Get down there. We came here to find good deals on a bias. Why did you just say you went there to buy something? Like, like what? You're, you're insisting on a good deal or you're not going to buy anything? What, you want 5, 10, 15, 20% off or else no sale? Of course, you just, just get in there, Chantel. Just get in there. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's, yeah, stuff yourself through a Samsung filter. Great, 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 great. I mean, I guess obviously they allow people to eat in, the, in a clothing store too, you know? I mean, she's still running by Canadian rules. Yeah, and 15 pounds of makeup too. Very modest of you. Yes, uh, Christy Claw, I got that. I got to get that footage and I got to integrate it in somewhere. It's just like, you know, I got other things to do and, and you know, I try to keep up with Chantel every day that, that I can. And uh, yeah, she and uh, Salad. Salah. I didn't mean to say it doesn't matter. I just I I I've sort of used up the salad jokes. Uh they walked past three men seated, and it's still not, you know, acceptable uh to be shooting footage. So like if she walks by, you know, like this, right? And they can tell that she's a you know, piece of wonder bread from Canada. And um Salah is tall and skinny and not at all intimidating. Those three guys are, are going to tell them off. And they were swearing at her in Arabic. So she already got yelled at them all by three men. She was pointing the camera. Yeah, I, I do have that footage. I got to integrate it into something a little bit later. So, um, hey there, sock puppet. <laughs> what do you got there? Is that, That's a wild boar <laughs> eating a cone. <laughs> Great emoji skills, sock puppet. Thank you. Seventy-one people here. We're doing well this evening. You see, th there are so many options for women in Kuwait. You can have any color you want, as long as it's black. <laughs> Oh, and Christy Claude just told us that what the guys were saying in Arabic was disgusting. I should spit on you. Yeah, that that's, you know, for a, a culture that, you know, um, they they don't appreciate that kind of stuff. Like here in Canada and United States, Europe, you know, everybody's doing selfies and shooting footage of everybody all the time over there. Yeah. So uh, Christy Claude, thanks for coming by. Colleen with a K. The translation was disgusting. I should spit on you. <laughs> Enchanted Rose, thanks for coming by. And now Trevor's saying that's not what the guys were saying. Well, they were saying something, and it wasn't friendly. I don't know. I don't know. I don't claim to know the language. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can have any style you want, as long as it's the same style as everything else. Yeah, hi, hi there. <laughs> um, you see, like the bottom fifth of the frame. I mean, you could see like a bit of a hint of uh, a shadow that you know her ginormous gut is. Well, we know where her gut is, right? Like, as if, as if she's married to him. Oh, as if. <laughs> I like your comment. I don't want to say it. However, I will put it up. <laughs> this one. <laughs> look, look at all the um you know all the attires behind her and like 
she's like, yeah, it's, it's like, hey, sock puppet, Sesame Street, one of these things is not like the other. One of these things just doesn't belong. <laughs> yeah, I saw a thumbnail on Yabba's where um, she got the, the mirror shot. The funny thing is, Yab is that size now. <laughs> and I actually watched part of it. Yab was running some footage of Pete's from somebody else's reaction channel. Like, it's one thing for all of us to take footage from Chantel or even Pete's, if that's what you want. I don't want Pete's footage. And react to it. It's like, Yab takes footage from other people's reactions and regularly reacts to them. I mean, she should just turn her monetization off if she has any respect for anybody when she does that. Are you watching tonight, Yabba? You suck. Okay, it's... uh. <laughs> and Chantel thinks she's hotter than 90% of the women on YouTube. All right, let's move. Let's move. We got 83 people here. Let's move this footage along. <sighs> look, 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 look how miserable he is. And look how fake her smile is. You know, there's only so much a filter can do. The, the attire is confusing the filter, so she looks even more fake and weird. Hello. Hello, guys. We're going to go check out some other stores now. Okay, something... They've got the music playing in the background. That's why it's all quiet. Look at this horrible camera work. Hey, look, there's cardboard boxes being ready to th be thrown in the garbage. Uh, walking around the whole mall area for extra exercise. Yeah, that's our Chantel. She'll shoot like two seconds of footage around the mall, and then she'll lie and say, I walked around the whole thing. Yeah, sure you did. I guess she can't talk when this footage is being shot because she's gasping for breath. Plus, they're terrified of being noticed, and so they just run the music. The escalator was crying. <laughs> and Chantel didn't, didn't fart. She shit herself. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's, let, let's not forget about, about Chantel's hand. Hands, you know. Their catcher's mitts. Their bear paws. It's a shortcut. <laughs> Oh, uh, let's keep moving. 84, 85 people here. There's a Wendy's here. I didn't know that. But I'm not here to try Wendy's. I want to try stuff I haven't tried. Oh, she wants to try more junk food she hasn't tried before. Something like this would cover me. Uh, she says at the bottom right, the captions, the shirts here were too small for me. Uh, yeah, there's no such thing as wildebeest in uh, this Kuwait mall. Fully. So Look at that. We got, we got somebody else I'm getting on the same page with. Pure evil. That's right. The dying scooter. Junk in her trunk. <laughs> not Wendy's. We want something exotic, like Hardee's. And by the way, this is your last chance to watch the uh, the footage. By the way, if you're just coming in now, I run this footage of this water treatment plant, water, whatever it is. It's a government building. And look at all the fencing and shit around it, right? They don't want people coming in. They have trees around it to hide it. And Chantel shoots footage of it, and she published it. It's illegal. So uh, this is your last. It's, so if you want to see it over and over again, go to the front. I mean, go to the start of this video after we're done. So this is, I'm just going to run it this one time because this is where it came from. And then we just roll over it. Uh, please excuse me, Deborah. Just going to get get that, uh, set it aside for a moment. Terry Bear. Hey, hey, hey. There's Bally. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Yes. Let's, let's roll it. Let's roll it. Last night, you saw us go to Dream Mall for some abayas and clothes shopping. And today we returned to. Yeah, there it is. Uh, Ministry of Electricity and Water, Aria Pump Station. <laughs> Asham, perfect comment. She has no respect for laws of Kuwait or any others anywhere. To check out the Lulu supermarket, we actually wanted to show you guys 
a couple of different grocery stores or where people buy food here in Kuwait. So we're going to take you to a private owned place. The well, there's nothing that says uh, a romantic, uh, charming couples channel than all kinds of like ugly, shaky camera footage shot from a fast moving car. The Lulu supermarket and a co-op, which is government owned. Let's check it out. So this, she just said this is a government owned co-op. Yet it doesn't look like, you know, like a utility, like, you know, a proper government building that, you know, the other place had a, you know, it looked mean. They didn't want you to come in here. The public is allowed. So anyway, technically speaking, this is another government. She said it's a government owned thing. We need lots of fries. Yeah, you, you do need lots of fries. If there's one thing that Chantel doesn't have enough of right now, it's loads of carbs Almarai is a very popular dairy company here really wow oh sorry the scene is over she shot it for like two seconds and it was go wow thanks thanks for letting us know that there's a very um popular company that makes milk products thanks they have this craft cheddar cheese spread very popular here Good. We're, we're glad you're zeroing in on uh, the processed craft cheese spread product. Interesting to see craft. Yeah, Almarai yogurt. Very popular. Very good. Yeah, very popular. Very good. As if she knows what she's talking about. Like she's been eating it for years. 101 people here. Thanks for coming by. Please consider subscribing. Wasn't that a fun thumbnail? That drew you in, huh? Yeah, I did a good job with that. Their milk. Milk and leaven is very popular here. There's a whole section of, of leaven. Yeah, it does look like an outdated dump, you know? This place makes Costco look like uh, shishi. Which is like a milk drink. Starbucks. <laughs> nice. Wow, you found Starbucks. Daniel Bastion is saying, wow, riveting, Wilderbeast. Thanks. You're giving us footage of Starbucks product. You know, that's something that we have not seen enough of, which is that Starbucks logo um, woman, you know, you know, giving whatever hand signals that is. It's like, we needed to see more of that. Look at that, everybody. It's a Starbucks uh, copyright trademark logo, whatever you want to call it, repeated a, a couple hundred times in front of us. That's great. We needed to see more of that. Thanks. Great content. Starbucks is everywhere. Lots of cheese, my favorite. Here's the whole craft section. We don't have this. We have. Yeah, yeah, that's right. You hover around the craft cheese section. That's just what you need more of. Craft cheese, but not this kind. Whoa cheese spread oh not another sock puppet reminding us that you know channel members such as not another sock puppet the starbucks logo is actually one of our custom emojis excellent use of the custom emojis not another sock puppet thank you for doing so what a clever bunch we have here thanks for doing that and then they have the almarai brand oh cool Santa cheese. How is it cool? You hate Christmas, Chantel. You hate Christmas. You said it several times over years. And, and now it's like, oh, cool. Uh, Christmas cheese. <sighs> Talkity talk, 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 talk. <laughs> Hovering around cheese spread. More cheese for the beast. Cheese and coffee, pathetic. And of course, she focuses on the two big brand names available for purchase. <laughs> string cheese. String cheese, exotic string cheese. I don't know. I, you know that 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 where did that come from? Europe, United States. Couldn't have come from Canada. We don't come up with anything. <laughs> I think we, well, hockey pucks. Crown Royal whiskey and maple syrup. That's what we, that's what we do here. That's it. And uh, so whoever, you know, in the Western world made string cheese, guess what? Chantal has found exotic string cheese. Look at all this Kiri cheese. Very popular here.
Yeah, yeah, very pop. As if she's lived there for years. Very popular. I love it, like Laughing Cow. Actually, the Almirai brand is a lot tastier, in my opinion, than the Kiri. Interesting, eh? No, no, it's not interesting. It's very boring. And all we can do is, is hear, like, the roar of the refrigeration to keep all that stuff, dairy product, you know, cold and sellable. Just roar, roar, roar. And then with every different scene, it changes. Very interesting. No, it is not. This is popular in the Arab world, Barbican. It's a fruity carbonated drink. It's actually really good. Wow. It's a fruity carbonated drink. Not unlike our own soda pop. I like how she says it's actually very good. Like, you know, you'll stop. Everybody stop. I know you've heard that it's poison. It's actually very good. You know, that, that's the proper use of the word actually. It's like if everybody thinks it's like drinking camel piss, she says, no, 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 no. It's actually very good. And she, and she wants us to believe she was actually in university studying English. She was cleaning toilets in university. That was it. You like barbican? Yeah. <laughs> it's good. These are various juices here. Wow, various juices. Well, Chantel, if you're looking for various juices, you'd have a whole lot more to choose from in Canada or the United States or Europe. And it's like, wow, we have various juices all available. Um, there's four or maybe six different kinds and only two name brands. Lemon mint. Christmas decorations. Yeah, I was just going to comment on it. It's just, it was gone in two seconds. It's like, hmm, Christmas decorations. She's so afraid of being caught with that camera. All they need is like one person to make a big stink and they're in trouble. So that's why it's like, hmm, Christmas decorations. It runs for two seconds. These Doritos are interesting. Yeah, no, they're not. No, no, that's another consumer product. You're shooting footage of a plastic bag of chips. It's not interesting. Your couple's channel is garbage. Cheeto Doritos. We don't have those. Tomato ketchup. My favorite. Well, I'm glad that you found your favorite Lay's potato chip in Kuwait. Thanks for sharing, Chantel. And French cheese. Yum. Yum. And then she shoots a little bit of a copyrighted music or a music video off of her tablet or his tablet. And um, yeah, that, that's smart. No, on to the co-op store. Cowboy dog. Okay, so this is the government-run store. This is the co-op store. I just it gets so confusing. It's like she was mumbling about a. Okay, so this is the government-run co-op store. This is. And she's just got the music playing in the background. That's why I have it muted. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i mean even she would stand in the middle of the aisle and, and you know run around like tracy allman in uh, that video for they don't know about us and they've you know at the last scene she won't even do that she's just aiming the, you know for all we know he's shooting this footage and she's in the car having her ice cream cone cones she's eating the whole damn box it's like well they're just gonna melt the laundry detergent here Wow, laundry detergent, something that you're not even going to use. There's still, there's multiple floors here. There's multiple floors here. And she shot that for like two seconds. There's multiple floors here. Gone. Fairy is the dish soap popular here. Fairy is for ladies. I need to dye my hair actually. I need to dye my hair, actually. It's like everything, it, what little she has to say is, is delivered as if it's really important and something that needs to get done. No, no one cares. I mean, you, you have a horrible diet. You, 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 you do drugs and all the time. It's like no one's worried about your hair. My hair's coming back, so. This is a really good price for fabric softener. That's a really good price for fabric softener. Why don't you just aim the camera at the floor 
and say, wow, these are some pretty good tiles on this floor. I bet if I could find them and if I was going to install them, they would probably work pretty good. Remove waterproof mascara. I really needed these. One KD. What? You got like a mountain of makeup products back at the at the townhouse in Canada. <laughs> And now it's amazing that you found whatever that is. Oh, I opened the wrong one. Ugh. And we know she doesn't wash. You know she doesn't laundry. Where's the soap, Chantel? Or dish soap? She's talking to the to get control. Yes! <laughs> it's popular because it's all they have. And if you complain, if you complain, if you complain, if you complain, and if you complain, if you complain, if you complain, they cut your arm off. In 650 fifths, translates to like five bucks, maybe. The cart's alone. Ghost cart. Yeah, now the cart is carrying the content. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what hair? What hair? How will help dye your hair? How is she going to color her hair? Hello, chat, Gary. Hello, KC. Thanks for the Thanksgiving thing. I'm in Canada. We're not having Thanksgiving. We had it earlier. <laughs> Thanks. Anyway. <laughs> when she was standing there in the middle of the mirror there, like you could see a hint of where her ginormous gut is. It's like, hey, baby. It's like, no, no. He's not getting anywhere near any of that. Not your problem. Yeah, the dinars are worth a lot. Yeah, I don't think I said it. Yeah, no kidding. Mm -hmm, that's cool. No. <laughs> right back to the footage, folks. 119 people here. Thanks for coming by. Come on on. Home Alone cart. They really like Nutella and Kinder here. Wow, exotic Nutella and Kinder. That's amazing. Because you so she can't go on the beach and just shit, shit there. <laughs> of course, that's what she likes to do, you know, in Canada, right? Pull over to the side of the road, take a dump in a ditch. So she can't sit or shit there at the beach and just do a live stream next to a palm tree and sit there and talk. Because somebody will come along and go, what, what is this? The camera? What? What? No, we're aiming the camera at ourselves. Doesn't matter. Is, is this required? Who say? What? You, no, we, uh, it, you know, Sal would be, it'd be telling her to put the camera away. Why? What for? Don't talk to them like that. We'll, we'll get rid of it. Well, we take camera. We take. Go. Go. She can't do that. That's why she's running around showing us fabric softener. There isn't anything else that she can do. It's crap. There's a whole kinder section. Yeah. That's what I was that's what I was gonna say. That's why she's showing us exotic Nutella and Kinder. There's a section of Nutella and Kinder, which is all over Canada, including our convenience stores. Like uh what's the name of the of the pizza chain? Pizza Nova here in, in Canada, Ontario, Canada. You go there and they have tiny little things of Nutella next to the cash register that you can get. It's everywhere. It's like, oh, look, well, we found the Tella and Kinder. Great find, Chantel. Great job. Um, look, it's exotic Kit Kat. Again, I can't even react to it. The footage was two seconds long. Can you imagine her? It's like, is anybody looking? Look, Kit Kat. Mm, yum, Kit Kat. Turn it off. I got to do something. Uh, fabric softener. Look, I'll be your lookout. There's no one in either aisle. Go, go, go. Oh, fabric softener. It's really uh, popular here. Oh, yeah. Okay, put it away. <laughs> see, did you like that bit? See, see how much more fun I am than Yaba? Huh? Talent, talent. There's more comedy here than, than, than Yaba and, and Frenchie put together. More talent, more comedy. Come over here. My favorite. This brand, it's a German brand. Yum. Chocolate cookies? Yeah. Look, 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 I gotta play that again. It's like chocolate cookies. And he looks at her. Yeah. 
remember like the, the the other episode she goes wow that's an amazing yacht and he says yeah here i'm gonna pull that back a little bit chocolate cookies yeah that's actually a good spot to start it it's like oh shit uh well i guess i have to i signed a contract i'll get something out of this they don't know just yet <laughs> run it yum chocolate cookies yeah <laughs> they're madly in love ladies and gentlemen hazelnut yeah. you guys love hazelnut chocolate here like nutella look, look how he slowly turns away from her <laughs> now i feel they are married ah! <laughs> thank you deborah Yes, chocolate cookies, and there is a lot of candy in that cart. Thanks, Casey, for that. Now, he's going to continue to turn away from her. You know, there's Chantel, blah, 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 and he just, just, he just, you know, floats away from her. Kinder. Kinder, yeah, yeah, kinder, kinder, that's good. 38 years old, you're worried about the fucking kinder. It's for five-year-olds. Yeah, uh, yeah, whatever. I, 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 I messed that up by talking over it too much. So delicious. So delicious, so delicious. It's you know something else, Salad? It's fresh. Yeah, whatever, whatever. Okay, I'll run that again. I talk too much. J just notice how he just gives up and walks away. You guys love hazelnut chocolate here, like Nutella, Kinder. It's so delicious. <laughs> I want to try some of this nougat. I love nougat and caramel. Oh. Car caramel is the same all over the world. It's it's that magic formula. You know, it's and you want to try it there like it's something different. Our cart so far. Here you go. Here you go, baby. Maltesers. You can get them in Canada. You can get them in the United States. You can get them in Europe. Wow. Exotic Maltesers. Here you go. Some Maltesers. <laughs> <sighs> Galaxy. Those are good. <laughs> Hazelnut. You know, for Chantel, anything with sugar is good. You know, we can't trust her. It's like, oh, those are good. Like, those are the good ones. For her, everything is good. Ripple Galaxy, yum. My next choice. Yella. So we're at a co-op store, which is government-funded versus private. So the prices are a bit cheaper here. Great, thanks. We'll fly over there tomorrow to enjoy those cheap prices and, and watch our Canadian dollars turn into, like, nickels. Oh. As soon as we get there. Thanks for the tip, Chantel. That's very helpful. Fabulous. Just trying to show you a variety of different grocery stores they have here. Yeah, that's amazing. Uh, you don't, you can't even come close to like a small grocery store in Ontario, Canada, or even, you know, something, even something like a modest American one, like kicks ass on this government run mess. Now, give us more advice while wearing what for you is a costume. Fruit and nut, my favorite. Fruit and nut. Snack. Snack? Yeah, snack. You know what Chantel needs more of? Snack. There's KC making fun of herself. KC. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, you said it. You said it, dear. I didn't say it. That's right. Chantel needs... You know, isn't that stupid? I mean, like, everything is a snack and gluttony. And here... It's because it says snack on it. When you eat 20 of them, you can pretend it's a snack. Those are good. Mm. Dairy milk, bubbly. Yeah, exactly what you can get in Ontario, Canada from Cadbury. How exotic. Like an arrow bar, kind of. <laughs> yeah, look at them turn away. Oh, shut up, please. It's not worth all the money in the world. If I... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she, whatever she said, it's like an arrow bar. And he goes, yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, Chantel doesn't have the sophistication to realize how bad this shit is. Oh, oh it's just like that. Yeah, yeah. What else? Snack. Snack? Those are good. Mm. Dairy milk, bubbly. Like an arrow bar, kind of. <laughs> yeah. Nescafe Station. Yes, you can get the instant coffee with all the sugar in it. It's kind of like Starbucks in the shoebox where you are with Sella. With um, you sleeping on the couch and he's on the the, the, the ground killing the uh, the scorpions. 
I'm gonna get some instant coffee. Three in one Nescafe. Fabulous. You get the powdered uh, sugar and the powdered milk and all the sugar and the chocolate and the vanilla. Just what you need. Spices. Hey, spice guy. I guess I guess that's how you talk to the to the mascots when you don't have to actually work for a living and you still have a handsome income. Da, 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 da. Hi, spice guy. Hi, spice guy. No wonder Pete's is the only man for her because it wouldn't bother her, him, him at all. Maggi, very popular here. Very popular. Yeah, it's also very popular all over the world. I can get Maggi stuff right here in Ontario, Rio, Canada. And so can everybody else in the United States and Europe. We can all get it. Oh, look, Maggi, very popular here. I get a couple of these lentil. Wow, how exotic! Meanwhile, all that we care about—well, we don't care. We find it entertaining. That it, well, like what is it? Is a bear paw a catcher's mitt? What else? Help me out. One hundred thirty-six people here. Hey, give me, give me some funny descriptions for her giant paw. <laughs> Anything? It's all, it's all open. They do. And she is. And how exotic. Mole paws. Mole paws. Was that another cat? I think it was a cat. A hoof. That's good. Turtle claw. Hoof. Turtle claw. Fascinating content, Chantel. Yeah, look at look at this is what Chantel is. Chantel, you're really bringing your A game. Here's footage of her grabbing a packet of soup. Pig hoof. Surgical glove balloon. That 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 sounds like a band name. Uh Opening for Super Tramp will be Surgical Glove Balloon. <laughs> I'm going to put Necessitas up there again. Thanks, Necessita, channel member. And a good co a comment. Hello. Hog bits. Mitt, a mitt, hog mitts, and mitts. Meaty claws. All right, okay, we're going to move on. I mean, I wasn't I wasn't saying that your comment wasn't good. It's good. It's just we got plenty of descriptions for our oversized lobster claws. Let's roll. My favorite. And some more chicken soup. <gasps> Indomie. I'm addicted. So we have gathered. Look, it, it's like ramen noodles, right? Right? Instant noodles. Well, yeah, the there you go, baby. Tons of sodium and starchy carbs. Just what you need. Of Usually when, when a woman's about to get married to a, a guy, uh, she will, like, you know, install a pool in the backyard using a shovel, trying to lose some weight and to look good for the wedding. I mean, Chantel was eating like a pig right up to this fake union. And during the honeymoon, she's stuffing herself. And now, well, you know, if they're taking one foot into wedded bliss, uh, she continues to stuff herself. It, it's just so ridiculous. No way are, are they in a relationship. There's nothing real. Here you go, baby. It weighs six pounds. Enjoy. Sounds good to me. Let's get it. Yella. Yeah, yella. <laughs> yeah, as, as if he's happy with that. Oh, my wife is going to be fatter than a hippo. Michelin man hands. That was good. That was good, too. <laughs> All the pasta. You love pasta, don't you? <laughs> Look at him. Is he, is he laughing? It's like, oh, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> you like pasta, don't you? <laughs> okay, whatever. You want to have me, you want to have me go getting the, 
the, the, the pasta. Okay, I'm going to get it. What's your look at look at look at the angry look on his face? Your favorite pasta, the macaroni? Yeah, he doesn't care. He's only getting it because you're making him talk and get things. What's your favorite, the macaroni? This one, this one he says. This it, it, let's just get out of the store. Here, is this good? Look at here. Macaroni. Macaroni. <laughs> Unicorn Fruit Loops. Never tried those. Are those in North America? The, the footage is two seconds. Look at that. Unicorns. Are those in North America? Done. It's done. And not the footage. It's just, I mean, like, that's all she spent on, on the cereal. Reese's. <laughs> Yummy. Peanut butter. Yeah, thank you. Why is a package of, of six full-size Reese's peanut butter cups funny? Reese's. <laughs> and then here's Sala, peanut butter. Yes, Sala, thank you. It's peanut butter. Amazing stuff. And it somehow it's funny. Cool, they have like a ranch. Heinz in a bottle, never seen that. No, that's not cool, ranch. You know what would be cool? If one of those bottles said camel flavor. That would be cool. Not, look, you found ranch from Heinz. Mayonnaise. All kinds of mayonnaise. All kinds of mayonnaise. Thank you. It's Chantel. All kinds of mayonnaise. Wow. Thanks. 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 You know, wouldn't it be nice if, if, you know, this guy really was well-to-do and they could just sit in his backyard? And just do a live stream in his fabulous backyard. You notice that he has no friends. There's no family. There's nobody that wants to get involved with this shit. All kinds of mayonnaise. Wow. Great material. Great material. If you're sitting there steaming away watching this, Chantel. Fantastic material. Boy. Great way to start a couple's channel. Tons of footage of consumer products that you can get here in Ontario, Canada, and all throughout the United States and Europe. Wow. I love these things. They're like real chicken. They're so good. Yeah, those are... Uh, here you go, baby. Look, it's frozen chicken strips. How amazingly unique. My favorite. Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. <laughs> Our favorite. I'll check you later, Casey. I try to keep track of all the comments. With the chicken tender. Yum. Look, chicken. Uh, chicken. Chocolate. Cheese ranch, yum, 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 yum. Uh, some of this, look, but it's got batter. It has lots of monosodium glue. Yum, yum. Another chocolate bar, candy bar, what, how, how you say? Here, yum, yum, yum. Strawberry Fanta, yummy. Raspberry Pepsi, I need to try that. Yeah, get that bear paw on, on, a, on a full sugar can of soda pop. Good idea. Get one from the back where it's colder. What? Get one from the back where it's colder? It's not even funny. How is that fucking funny? It's colder. <laughs> you mean you, you, you want like, you know, it to be, theoretically speaking, a little bit better. That you can't even discern the difference just so it'll taste a little bit sweeter and have a little bit more pop when you're, you know, I mean, like, oomph when you're drinking it. Deborah Saunders says, hate it when she says yum. Mm. There we go. All right. Labna? Uh, Turkish Labna. Yum. Here, look, it is something. Yum. Here's something else. Yum. Is this? It's... Delicious, uh, full of sugar and salt and fat, just like your fucking McDonald's here. What do you say? Yum, yum, yum. Like a cream cheese and butter. After the co-op, we stopped by a friend's who made us some... No, you didn't. There's no friends. You stopped by at a friend? Okay, put somebody else in this footage. You don't. Arabic Syrian style coffee. The dark brown instead of the blonde that I'm used to. It was very fragrant and strong, but very delicious. Oh, wow. Look, everything is delicious. Oh, that's so amazing. So much excitement you bring. It was very delicious.
All right, we're here picking up roasted chicken, Syrian style, right? Yeah. <laughs> He's just waiting for the day to be over. We're getting roasted chicken while I'm wearing this costume, right? Yeah. I don't, I don't know. Is it, the look on his face is it like deer in the headlights or just, you know, desperation, a mixture of both. And roasting is a healthier way of eating fried-style chicken. Um, yeah, if there were any friends, i uh, sorry to bother. Uh, I'm here with so Will the Be... Look, Sala, we don't want any part of that. We don't want any trouble, okay? We don't want we don't want to get our arm chopped off. Just get off the property. I, I'm i sorry. Stop talking to us, Sala. I'm just looking for some... Co here, take it. Take it. Take the kettle. Take the pot. Take it all. Just take it. Just get off the property. Take it. It only it uses less oil, and it's a combination of cooking, uh, frying, and I think pressure cooking. But it's also marinated chicken. It's supposed to be tastier and healthier. So, roasted chicken. We'll show you when we get home. Yella. All right, here's the food. Some f look, look, they're eating on top of a transparent garbage bag on that little footstool that he calls a table. Fresh pita bread. Pickles and greens hummus and here's the roasted chicken it looks very crispy with some fries and they always this is standard they give you this as like a tablecloth to keep clean to you they give you that because even wearing the attire which you don't respect and you're treating it like a costume they can still tell that you're white trash from canadia your table clean Hello guys, now I'm gonna try the first bite of the food. Look, look at look look at them, look at them. She's waiting for him to play his part and he's miserable. It's like I have to eat this shit on camera. That's what they're saying. They, they they're not talented enough actors and, and they have to produce too much footage. It's just like a misery for both of them. That was going to be the thumbnail until I noticed that she was shooting government buildings and I had to like take a screen grab of the government building sign. The thumbnail was going to be somewhere around here and then I had to change it when I realized she had broken the log again. Yummy. Maybe. Try the hummus. Hummus. Mmm. So good. Enjoy the hummus. You like it? Hummus is very good with the food. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Uh, hummus is very good with the food. Yeah. Wow. Th thanks. Um, I think there's like 20 or 30 different types of hummus in my local grocery store. And it's like, hey, hummus is very good with the food. Yes. Thanks. Thanks to the two of you. That's fucking fabulous. Great material. We'll make a balance. <laughs> Very healthy, too. Mm. Looks super crunchy. Mm. I did I did a little bit of editing for you guys, okay? Here we go. Did this last for about a minute and a half? Here you go. Juicy, tender. Super crunchy and not oily and greasy. not greasy and oily like KFC at all. Yeah, it's more healthy, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, the Western way and KFC. Oh, this is much better. This is so superior. This is much better than the KFC, the Colonel from the Southern United States. This is the best way. Fuck off, Chantel. This one's spicy. <laughs> oh, nice.
Oh. <laughs> Just fall down in the ketchup. <laughs> oh my goodness. It fall down in the ketchup. <laughs> oh, 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 that's so funny. <laughs> yeah, that could be the beat for a song. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> Cringe. <laughs> they fall down, go boom. <laughs> Pig. <laughs> All the pigs. <laughs> oh, it fall in the ketchup. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's right. It's the only time he smiled. And look what amuses him. <laughs> Chicken fall in the ketchup. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, dang. <laughs> That's right, foodie beauty. Don't mess with the colonel. You know, they buy stuff out of a bag in a government run supermarket in Kuwait. Oh, it's so much better than KSC. Fuck off. Okay, 146 people here. This is almost the end of the footage, okay? So uh, I got a funny little way to end it. The kids will be kids. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The Western world is paying your bills. Uh, let's see, Chantel. Is there a platform that's, you know, originating from Kuwait that you can join up and uh, go nude on and do drugs on? And um, if you even talked about going nude and even mentioned doing drugs, they would be at your door and then they cut your arm off. <laughs> you like ketchup on your chicken? Yeah. Oh, then good. That's good news. <laughs> that's all she gave us. That's everything. wondering if anybody had any intention to email them this reaction that we just did together with all the footage of her creating footage of a government building and publishing it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just asking questions. One hundred and forty six people here. We had a blast with this, huh? <laughs> Thank you, Leon Babe. I don't know if anybody found out exactly what those men at the, at the mall said to her. I'm just sitting here humming, that's all.
<laughs> Sometimes I just like to hum like that. So we've got 138 people here. Thanks very much for coming by. She already did another live stream after she published this. I've already saved it. So we got some silliness to go work on for tomorrow. And um, thanks for your comments. Thanks for coming by. If you want to leave the theater now, that's okay. That's cool. We're going to stick around and chat for a little bit. I'm going to drive it over an hour and 10 minutes. Of course, when I say that, then we end up staying for like two hours longer. So, um, so thanks everybody for coming by. Please subscribe. 139 people here. Please subscribe. It only takes a moment. Do you think I do a better job than Yaba and Frenchie? And please subscribe and like it. Make a comment after we're done too. Come back. Make a comment. There's your mama nose. I love that avatar. So let's just, uh, so it's 136 here. Like, that way I ain't got no more footage. I'm not trying to get you out of the theater faster. I'm just letting you know that the footage is done. And I'm going to hang around here and talk with you guys for a few more minutes, drive it over an hour and 10 minutes. And then I'm going to do my little Chantel song. You know, the, the, the one at the start with the, the real crochetter. He did a fabulous job redoing it with his buddy Bettina and the mysterious Mr. Editor. Mr. Editor. Ugh. There ain't no filters here. And hundred hundred and twenty five people here. I'm just checking out some comments. Not another sock puppet is quoting what Yabba once said about me back when we were friends. Put some respect on his name. FBRC, one of the best reaction channels out there. Put some respect on his name. <laughs> and put some super chat cat towards you. We really dig your avatar, not another sock puppet. Get up there, super chat cat, and say thanks. I know. We're all waiting for the camera. Come on, camera. Boom. They, hey, that's good. Look, Super Chat Cat's got the full stage here. He's beckoning good luck. Yes, let me sing. Super Chat Cat! Super Chat Cat! Thanks for blessing us, not another sock puppet. That's a real big name. And we like it. Whenever I mess it up, I start from the top. Super Jack Kate! Super Jack Kate! Thanks for blessing us, not another sock puppet. We hope to bless you, back. It's Super Jack Kate! Super Jack Kate! Super Jack Wow! Thanks very much, not another sock puppet. And uh, you're already a channel member, too. So you're helping us all the time as it is. Wow! And you were uh, great with the custom emojis this evening. Wow! Thanks! Wow! Wow! Thanks. Thank you, Super Jack Cat. Thank you, not another sock puppet. Let's leave that up there for a while. <gasps> While we hang around and talk. And if you make a comment right after you do the Super Chat, we just put your comment up there because it's just like leaving your Super Chat up there. Uh, uh. Now, just because it doesn't show up here on my stream yard, that doesn't mean that people don't get it when they're in the chat and, uh, you know, on a normal browser and stuff. <laughs> you know, it's funny, uh, Steph Villa, did they even have a bathroom in that little room of his? Chantel is always showing us the toilet wherever she goes, and she's always talking about going to the toilet. Every three or four episodes, doesn't matter what. So if ever there was a time to show off the toilet, it would be there. We know where the toilet is. It's down the hall. 
Either that or it's the same plastic bag that they were eating on top of on that footstool. <laughs> Cat Crew Las Vegas, they use a litter box. They probably do. Or Sally says, I'm going to go for a walk over there under a tree. If you could get up and walk, I'm not moving here. Plastic bag. Just tie it up and throw as far as you can away from the shoebox we are in, please. Good enough. Just as long as it's not where we sleep. You on the couch, me on the floor. I kill the scorpions. Until you go back to Canada. Linda Lou's digging this. Calling with a K is digging this. Jeff D is digging this. Steph Vila is digging this. Look at everybody's digging the comedy that we're still coming out with. They go in the sand, Unicorn Blow. Here's Chantel. Salah, where's like the bathroom? You see over there? Desert. Okay. What happens at night, we don't care. Go over the do and whatever natural happens. Okay. We don't care here. It's a big sandbox. Yes. Just don't do it here. If you get stuck in this shared bathroom, we both get in trouble. They call the secret police, the royal family. First, they cut off my arm, then yours. Wait until it is nighttime. The desert is there. Linda Lou says, I love those edits. Thank you, Linda Lou. <laughs> Leon Bay providing us with a emoji of K. Thanks very much. Teresa S. says her bubble will burst when she gets back. No couples channel, no husband. She'll go back to her old ways because she believes her train wreck scored the most points, but she'll tank anyway. Can't wait. Yeah, I guess she's you know, in a haphazard way, made an attempt for this to be a successful couples channel. It's just crap. Because, you know, as one of you guys here says, your mother told you, being sly doesn't mean that you're clever. And like I always say with Chantel, just because she lies and prospers by lying doesn't mean that she's a mastermind. <laughs> I don't know if she paid for the villa this month. Number one princess says, hi, everyone. Hello, number one princess. Thanks for coming by. I'm just, I'm just reading all the comments. Not on the sock puppet gets to stay up all by himself there. Or whatever the gender is for sock puppet, because all we have to work with is Oscar the Grouch. In a garbage can, which is great. I love that avatar. They are there with the bear bear. Thank you again, another, another sock puppet. That was very nice of you to do. Fun avatar, fun comments. There, there, bear, bear, right there. <sighs> yeah, Chantel told, told a horrible story about killing a frog when she was a kid. And it's like, why do you want to share that story? And you're laughing while you're telling it. Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> I don't think that uh, Chantel has the ability to bring Sala down to the level of Pete's. Pete's is a whole other animal entirely. A simp.
please feed me. <laughs> That that that's got to be they got to use that for for their tourist industry. Kuwait, it's slightly better than when Saddam was running things. Please visit today. My comments all over the place. Hey, Feudy Booty said something about Christian having to cover. She is Catholic, so she referred nuns as Christian. Well, the nuns are Christian. I, I don't quite know what you mean. Yes, he's just humiliating to himself and all other people that know him without Chantel adding to it while she's away. <laughs> I don't know if Pete's is really autistic. Even if he is a little bit, it doesn't mean that, like, you know, he's, you know, utterly, severely autistic. I don't, I don't think so. When, when he, um, pretended like he was going to hurt himself, and then the next day he was telling off Natter, I said, that's it. I write Pete's off. Write him off. Whatever he is, he's evil enough to pretend like he was going to hurt himself. He got a big video out of it, lots of money. Then the next day, he was just clowning around, telling Natter off part of the fake fight. These people get no mercy from me. It's like, you know, Amberlynn, Chantel, they get lots of, they get a handsome income just because they, they, they insist on staying huge and going on camera. That's the only thing that makes them interesting. And they're sticking with it because it gives them their money. And of course, when you criticize them, she's, oh, I got an eating this. Get out of here. You don't. I, I wouldn't, if I was you, I wouldn't waste a lot of time talking with Pete's and trying to figure out what the hell he has to say. <laughs> he started memberships. <laughs> well, all we can do is guess. I mean, like, even though professionals can make a mistake about that, you know, even if we want to take our best shot, it's not like we have him in front of us to interview and, you know, to take notes. Chantel is his buddy, and they're both dishonest, and they're both clowning around on YouTube, spinning webs of lies for money. Catholic nuns is not what she is like. Is I don't know what you mean. Nuns are Christian. Mm -hmm. Or to be a little bit uh, casual with the description, he's a simp.
Okay, I'm going to do the song. Because unlike Chantel, I don't want to be on camera and be boring to anybody. I've been talking, 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 talking steady. And I worked on my footage before we got started. And I did some pre-recorded stuff. I put effort into it. I care about the audience. If I'm starting to get a little bit weak, I'm going to walk off the stage myself. Even though I still got a lot of gas in the tank. You can tell. I got lots of energy right now. I just I don't have any footage left. Chantel's given us a live stream after she published the, the horse shit that we just reacted to. I got to get to that. So let me get on top of it. And I'll have something for you like tomorrow. Because it's 10.52 p.m. Eastern Standard Canadian Time. November 24th. And want to get my shit together for tomorrow. And entertain you guys tomorrow. With whatever the hell Chantel's provided us with. Hey, man! Uh, you gotta get back on this uh, scale, man. I mean, you said that you were gonna lose weight, man. And, uh, you gonna ever do it again, huh? Well, all I can do is hold on to this. But I look different. And I got all kinds of lighting here, too. And, uh, I just had been so busy. You know, that, that car that I have, you've only seen like twice, is such a misery behind the scenes just to put that thing on the road. So, uh, you know, if I'm having a busy day, it's just I don't follow the diet. I don't. Now, I haven't, you know, totally fallen off the wagon. Obviously, I haven't because I'm still under 300. You just, I do my next weigh-in when I get when I lose 50 pounds. So I got to go from the 341 I started at down to 2... two. 240, not 240, 291. <laughs> From 341 to 291. Super Chat Cat is looking at me saying, yeah, yeah, dummy. Don't do math on live television. Make yourself look like an idiot. I'm sorry, Super Chat Cat. Sorry, sorry. Mm. Let's catch you a few more comments. All right. Gonna hit it. I just want to read more, more of the. Well, the thing is, I, I like reading the comments. It's just if I sit here and read the comments, it's kind of dull. It's like, what's what's that dummy doing? Uh, yeah, I'm reading the comments. Sarah Lee, I'm going to grab that one. Three, two, one. Chantel. She carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel, she carries the weight. Yeah, yeah. Chantel, she carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel, 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 she rolls out of bed. With nothing better to do, she rolls right back to bed after the muck bang is through. She makes a mess, she makes a couple of dollars. You're going to do it again. It's all too much for you. Ooh. 
to understand. Come on, sing it again. A chantel. Oh, she carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel. Oh, she carries the weight. Chantel. She carries the weight of the world on her shoulders. Chantel. 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 Chantel.